Good afternoon, gentlemen. Active Aussie here. Early Friday afternoon. I'm just at Peg's Lookout, Tarragindi, here in Brisbane. This is one of my favourite places, and this is a beautiful spot to watch the sunset, especially in winter, but any time of year. It's really great. I'm just going to make a sort of non MGTOW video this afternoon. I'm planning on coming up here next Thursday night to try and spot the so-called Devil's Comet or P12, the Ponds Brook, Ponds Brook's Comet. I think that's, it's named after the people who discovered it and apparently about an hour after sunset fairly low on the horizon it will be quite visible even to the naked eye although there might be a little bit too much light pollution just in this area here but I'm still hoping I can get a bit of a look and then later on in the year I think August or September there will be another comet coming through the solar system and that may be like 10 times brighter than this P12 comet, so it could be um, quite spectacular. I um, used to really be into astronomy about 20 years ago, but I don't really um, get into it so much these days, but still have some interest. That P12 is called the Devil's Comet because of the two horns it appears to have, which is just the... Um, outgassing as it comes closer to the sun and this second comet which has like a um, Chinese sounding name I can't remember the exact name for the time being that one is going to be very spectacular also so I'm going to um, be looking out for that that's around about the orbit of Jupiter at the moment I think so it's going to be a few months before it comes closer toward Earth. And um, just talking about like comets and asteroid, they are probably the two biggest sources of clickbait on the internet, on social media. And whenever there's like a comet coming through the solar system, there's always some BS story about how it, it might impact Earth, which is usually... Um, a lot of BS, although in the past some fairly large asteroids actually have crossed Earth's orbit, so the asteroids are actually like some type of threat, but are very rare for a large comet to impact with Earth. Maybe some of you guys are into astronomy, so I just thought I'd talk about this. Speaking about the devil, I heard that song this morning, um, Evil Woman by ELO and a few days ago they were playing that song Devil Woman by Cliff Richard on the radio. Two great songs and um, fairly relevant for us um, sort of MGTOW red pill type guys. Anyway I'll come back up here on Thursday night Anzac Day here in Australia which is when we remember our fallen soldiers and Anzac Day is still very relevant I feel and yes we should never forget it's um more important than Australia Day I feel Australia Day now is just a lot of sort of hollow meaningless fluff and rhetoric doesn't really mean so much nowadays that's um about all I really wanted to say just a sort of um light topic video for a change. I'll um, talk to you again soon, hopefully. Cheers.